Um, I'd like to, first of all, I'd like to give Carolyn a clap because I think he's done a good, uh, good job of summarizing a, um, a difficult process. Um, I'd like to thank you all for coming and engaging actively in the process. I think, um, you know, there's been um, a lot of really good contributions over the last few months. Uh, I think what we've tried to demonstrate tonight is that uh, we're not ignoring those, con those contributions by any means, we're actually taking account of them and, and taking full account of them. Um, in, a, in, a, in a genuine way, uh, so we can we can get uh, a, a, um, a process back on track, which uh, which engages the profession, <coughs> engages everybody, uh, and uh, we've really got to start trusting each other here. And if we don't trust each other, we won't get anywhere. Uh, so I really, because uh, it, it, it's um, for all the patients that we serve that we need to do this. It's not for our benefits, for the patients that we serve. And um, you know, pharmacists, um, community pharmacy in particular, have a unique opportunity in, in a sense with, with this. When we talk about equity, actually, pharmacy probably has, of any health professional, has some of the greatest reach into the community because of the number of sites from which you operate from. Uh, so if you're looking at targeted equity, then actually you've got a huge opportunity here. So let's grasp the opportunity, let's work together, let's trust each other, let's focus on our patients, and let's get the job done. Thank you for coming.